Hello, it's me again. So, go to the description down here in the video and uh, go to the link for the launcher, install it, and on the first uh, startup you should be prompted to uh, select the executable for each game, for Amatu Vanilla, if you got both, and uh, also for Arrowhead. If you're using a beta patch, you should uh, also browse to that location. Um, on this launch options tab on the left you got launcher options so if you start the game over this launcher you can select what should be done do nothing minimize hide close it speaks for itself um, over here performance I only use CPU count so for me I have dual core huh, yes I have I used uh, two if you have a quad use for uh, speaks for itself on the right side I'm only using run the beta patch um, and no splash screen so if you check that one year it's running the beta patch of course and if you uncheck it it's the stock uh, retail patch uh, over here you can skip the intro no splash screen so when you do a bit editing I'm not that familiar with editing but I try some missions and stuff and when I go back to desktop and back in game it's sometimes a bit boring to watch the video all the time in the intro so you can skip it with this one and I also use this default world if you leave it empty then in the main menu is only water uh, it's good if you use if you're launching custom islands like uh, icebreakers duala for example or lingor um, you leave this one empty and then the game loads faster and because you're loading another island um, if you know that you play maybe Domination on Chernerus, you pr you can preload Chernerus. The game is loading a bit longer, but it's preloading the Chernerus map. And in the main menu, the, you have the Chernerus scenario in the back. Especially if you're uh, launching combined operations, uh, you can select in here what to preload. Otherwise, just uncheck it if you're not interested. Over here in additional parameters, I'm using a dual core, as I said, like putting CPU count on 2 on the left. Um, I use x threads equals 0 because it's better for my performance with a dual. So uh, you can put additional stuff in here. Um, over here you see what's going to be launched. Um, that's the modification of the executable itself. It starts with minus mod and then the path and then all the add-ons you're launching. The add-ons I'm launching right now for example. On this right side you can select the game version Arma 2 Vanilla, OA or Combined Operations. If you're not familiar with all this community stuff and you don't have people who can tell you and you ever wondered why you get kicked on servers because you're missing content, it may be like for 90% that you're not running Combined Operations. You either play Arma 2 Vanilla or Arrowhead, but you can also use Combined Operations because it has mixed content. And then you can select it over here, what to launch. Okay, that's the main features. I look again. Yeah, that's the options for launching it. Uh, yeah, so we're going to the add-on tab.